welcome to the Nomad Channel of the Marissa Allen Support Network, where you know I got so much pride stuff in this hood. You might as well pull the trigger if you think of taking this leather off my back, or if you think of disparaging or assassinating Marisha Harlow's character. Well, you see, tonight's theme is for our lolly with its extravaganza. We're blade, we're breaking the glass ceiling. We're putting the spotlight where it belongs, and we're handling the business. Yes, indeed, I am. The Nomad Shadow, Marissa Harlan Support Network President, and I am El Padrino of the Sons of Liberty, True North Original. Now, this is the Bad Adjustment Bam. We're going to take our swings and we're going to do whatever the fuck we want. We're going to say whatever the fuck we please. And you game sure you know we got four out strong. We're kicking ass and we're holding all those accountable and responsible. You must be a dead man walking. Bam! If you think I'm taking a swing at me, because I am the enforcer of the justice. I got four accounts strong and you damn sure know I do whatever the fuck I want. I say whatever the fuck I want. And if you make the rules, well, I will break them. Now roll. Can you see the Sons of Liberty True North original Nomad Chatter of the Marisha Harlan Support Network? You better pull the trigger because I got so much pride stuff in this cunt that you will never get this letter off my back. Because if you're not lost, then you won't allow with that bullshit in the minds in season four where they're ripping the cuts off of the sons of anarchy members. That would never happen. You don't just give up your cut. You see, pull the trigger, motherfucker. This ain't coming off my back. I'm dead television. I'm here with the pride and the respect and the love for the justice that I see. Because mama... Marissa Aglet, you never have to be a coach stop anymore. You don't get the credit you deserve. You don't get the spotlight you deserve. And you don't get the attention you deserve. Let's see. Music CDs. Where are they? Singing, dancing, Thompson. Where are they? T-shirts, hoodies. This hoodie I'm wearing right now is made in Pakistan. So you're telling me you, we can't get some goddamn merchandise? Well, Marissa Aglet, Come on now. So, as a sports person, and as a bodyguard, bam, all for free, we're going to take our swings and make sure. Welcome to the new man channel of the Marish Island Support Network. This is the church of the Son of Liberty, True North Originals, that you know, you dare piss me off, you dare cross the club, you dare... Do something stupid to Marisha Harlan. Say something to fairies. Say something that comes out your mouth that is trash. What you see on part one, we're stepping up, we're breaking that glass ceiling, and we're making sure you'll meet Mr. Mayhem. Did you see what that says? That says, Men of Mayhem. Mr. Mayhem right here. Because that's what it will be, courtesy of. Because Mr. Mayhem is rocking. On part one, you see what tonight's Hollywood theme is? We're breaking that glass ceiling. And we're never leaving the name back. Because if you want to cross me and Maria Starla, then find out what does Men of Mayhem mean? What does Mr. Mayhem mean? Well, you want to get more unfortunate son of a bitch? To find out, because I am the baddest motherfucker. I'm this motherfucker. Because I step up and run this motherfucker. Four counts strong, two lolly with extravagances at the same time. You see, you better pull the trigger, because you ain't getting this leather off my back. I'm here to represent, and I'm here to leave an impact. Bam! Part one. You see, for Mama for Judy, we're breaking the glass ceiling. And we're most definitely leaving an impact for Mama, because you should. Fear this face because you have done enough to fuck with Marissa Arlette's career. Now, Pakistan, I show you 
Marissa Harlett, well then you must be foolish. Now, we're going to break that glass ceiling, and we're going to make sure Mama gets the credit she deserves. Where we are handling club business tonight, because we're stepping up, and we're most definitely fired up. And this is part two, because what's the theme tonight? That's right. We're breaking that glass ceiling. We're taking our swings, and I'm stepping up, because no matter what, there's so much pride stuff in this cut. Pull the motherfucking trigger. If you know me, I'm the baddest motherfucker on here. Because I know with the pride that I got with the bad justice in my head. Come and try me. I dare you. You really want to feel 38 years of pain and suffering? You'll be bored. Now, man. <laughs> For all you tiny needle dick men. I'll be near and beg her skin and tell them a woman to sex me in. Well, you know me. I love sex. I love having sex. And sex is just the best. Now, what the fuck is so wrong with sex? Pakistan and India? Damn, Marissa Arlette, sex guy. Damn, sexiest top boy girl in the world. They can see where I was flying today. Woo! Welcome to the most kick ass. Badass entertainment you're ever gonna see. If we step up, we handle that little business. Because this is church. This is my sanctuary. And this is what I love with all my heart and soul. Because the fact that ain't true, I do whatever the fuck I want. I say whatever the fuck I want. And the answer is no. I'm gonna do whatever the fuck I want when I want. Because from Marissa Harlan. Well, nobody else is stepping up. Nobody has the wibbles to come get some. Well, I actually know for challenge every day. Come and get some, you dumb motherfuckers. Ah, ah, ah. And I'll remind you, what has Marissa Harlot done wrong? Nothing. Never ever had a boyfriend, so she does not have a fat, ugly, Mario looking, fat motherfucker boyfriend. By the way, I'll lop his head off with his ball back. He is no harmless than a damn pussycat. Now, this soldier's face, well, we shut that fat motherfucker up with a ball back of justice. His bullshit. Come on now. See that dumb to think that generals in America are sleeping with Hollywood actresses. So you're thinking, yeah, you guys are dumb. That they, generals of Pakistan, have the power to sleep with Hollywood actresses. You stupid motherfuckers. Now, look at her face. Look at her facial features. And know all that fake porn bullshit so damn green. You can't even tell who the fuck's in it anyway. So how the hell can you even think that works all right anyway? See, we step up. We had no club business. And we kick ass. Because we're bad at it. If you're not about it, I'll leave an impact. The guy am. Dan Brown and Al Padrino. I am the president of the Nomad Chata of the Marisha Harlan Support Network. To remind you everything I do. Oh, yes, indeed. <laughs> we are the fattest motherfuckers running this four count strong to the Hollywood extravaganzas. Because we step up. We do something bold. 
brave, original, and tonight we're breaking that glass ceiling and mama is the leading man of our movie that I love you until the very end. Step up or shut up because the fact that made you there's nobody better than Marissa Harlett, honey. Love ya!